Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the Ender All Forgotten Stories playthrough. We are, of course, in some sort of ruin. Glowstone Grotto at the moment. As we just got through the, uh... Real cool Graves Path area. Looks like we're getting into more... Alive territory. We're leaving the undead behind and going towards bandits. So what us. Let us make lettuce of them. Freaking vagrants. Kill them all! They still don't even know where I am. I wonder if I can actually hide. After we shot that many bows. Or shots of them? Be hilarious. That's class. That's peak Skyrim right there, if that's the case. <laughs> Must have been the wind. Stop running for a second, I can shoot them. Oh, crap. No, you won't, because you won't find me, I guess. A sneak skill is even that good. <laughs> Bear is dumb as hell. They're as bad as my archer skills. Alright. It worked out. So I think that leads out where I was talking about earlier. There just happens to be a little part in between, I guess. Ooh, these staves are worth some money. Uh, you can keep the rest. Keep the change, you filthy animal. Anything good here? Not really. There is a big chest. A massive chest up there. First, let's find the bandits. Move on. It's like a human heart, I guess. <laughs> Can never have enough human hearts. That's what Grandma always used to say. Kind of weird now I think about it. Spare parts, okay. I don't even know why I need all these spare parts. If we do end up buying a house... Oh, there's another band out there. Then we'll probably end up using spare parts to build stuff for it, maybe, or something. I don't know. Alright, let's break him. Piece of cake. Come back here. <laughs> He's a slidey one. Oh, good, a torch. Need more of those. Uh, I'll take the shield and leave the rest. Why is it? Why am I able to move and then I pull out my torch and then I'm not? Is it? Oh, I see. When the shield is in my hand, it weighs less. That's dumb. <laughs> but also it makes sense, I guess. What do we have here? Scienta Sinistra, Sionic Splitter Tier 2. That looks like a special kind of book. Interesting. Where is it? Is it a uh, consumable? Yes. Makes an enemy fall into rage for three seconds. Psionic skill increases or raises the duration and effect. Higher tiers enable stronger enemies to be bound by this talent. Cost one memory point to learn. Cost a memory point to learn? I think not, my friend. <laughs> I think we'll sell that one. There's no way in hell I'm using a memory point of that. Uh, maybe I'll keep it, I don't know. Oh, wait. Oh, actually, it's a satiating food, okay. I have far more valuable things to get than that with my memory points. 
Maybe there'll be a point where we don't, and it might come in handy. I don't know, but like I don't see that being something I'll ever really need. If I'm honest. So I'll probably just sell it. But the fact it's like specially hidden here makes me want to keep it. I'm not desperate enough to se have to sell it. Maybe I'll just put it in a box. In the box, rather. Forever. So we can get out of this way, it looks like. Let's have a look. <clears throat> I can always go back. Anything else in here? Nope. Take me outside. We'll see where we come out. Bellstorm Grotto. Maybe this is the cave I was trying to get to before and I couldn't. It was on top of that mountain. Well, that was somewhere up there, I thought, so maybe not. I don't know. This is a very big area. Nope. We're not alone here, Jimmy. There be wolves abound. What's this? Here we go. Farmer's throne. God damn you. Oh. <laughs> Over here. Where is it? There it is. Rabid fox. Get the fox out of here. It's so dark. Ah, I have to keep my good enough. There we go, he gave us some light. Thank you. You've done well. Very good. Alright, I did see a nice claw. The more of those the better, quite frankly. Alright, let's see what's on this farmer's thing. So we have a light we can use. You can't argue with these mages. They'll attack. We can mage light and then put our shield back on, we can walk again. It's a dead troll. Also, why is it called Farmer's Throne? <laughs> it's kind of odd. Rhetoric Book Adepts. Hmm. Horseshoe and a recipe for Ambrosia. Sure. Farmer's Throne? Doesn't have a lot going on. Not for us. Anything else out here? Is it actually like a farmer's place? What is this? Where the hell are we? <laughs> I don't, I don't know. Yes! I am! Is that obvious? What do we have here? What do you, what do you, what is this? <laughs> this looks like a town or something. Might be, actually. You know, if they had a vendor, that'd be quite useful. Upper haystacks? Pretty cool area. Look at me. No. Not interactable signs like the R and Arc. Which is fair enough. Only Arc really is big enough to warrant that, I guess. Nice. Nice claw. That's what they should be called. Okay, what is this? We'll probably come back and explore this. Even though it probably has nothing anyway. It's just like a farmer's village or something. Honey brewery at the upper farm. That's a real dog. Oh, there's people here. <gasps> Pack mules. Nice. Oh, child, what are you doing over here? Aren't you? No. Have you been to? Oh, how do they say? No, I don't think I have. Mele? My dad told me that's, <laughs> that's great. Um, uh, okay. There's a bit more going on here than I was expecting. I am Lord Borex Farm. Hmm. I still kind of want to go out the pipe in the bandit lair. 
Yeah, those are cool. Yes? Any, what news from the Mark? News? Where have you been these past moons? The whole city's talking about nothing else but the Mad Magister. Thirty dead novices. Oh, boy. How could something like this happen? Within the Order? Yeah, I don't know. Alright, uh, maybe we'll come back and talk to Boric. Maybe not, I don't know. For now, though, I'm on a mission. And my mission, whether I choose to accept it, which I do, because it's my mission. <laughs> Who else is going to accept it? Is to uh, keep looking. Same statue of some dude. Nothing lootable. Nice area, though. Some lovely locales. Like, look at this shit. Oof. Okay. This area is, looks awesome. I love it. I like how it's got, like, trees and cliffs and waterfalls. It's just a serene area. Big old farmhouses. Also, I like how the clouds, like, obscure the, uh, mountains. I'm sure Skyrim does that as well. But it looks pretty good here. Ooh. Time for a bath. I guess that'd be a shower, technically. Walk blessed, dear traveler. You probably don't know this, but unfortunately the street you're walking on is owned by the Honorable Mysore Croco. And sadly, 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 he himself has ordered that all wanderers must pay a fee so that we can keep the streets in good condition. So please, be so kind and pay. That will save both of us the trouble. Hmm. 250 pennies. Uh. Very convincing, but not convincing enough. Leave before I hurt you. Uh. uh. Okay, point taken. You're one of the tough kind. Not that you'd stand a chance against us, but we're not in the mood for trouble today. We'll let you go for now, but next time you'll pay. Believe me. Mm. Fighting me, are you, man? I have a feeling next time we come through here, there's going to be like an ambush on us or something. Ah. Myrid. Oh, they have these pack things. <laughs> There's such weird creatures in this. I love it. You're the Myrid Keeper. Who are you? Oh. <gasps> a secure chest. What's this? An urgent help for a beloved one. You can meet me at the Red Ox. Search for Meryl Hoofbeat there. Okay. I'm down. Down for that. I feel like singing never ending story while looking at him. I'm not gonna, of course, ever. <laughs> well, and I don't sing in two. I don't know the words. But I could. Ooh, gold ore. Okay. Oh, shit. Shield on? What? It was. That gold orb just put us over the edge. Damn it. World. Still not enough? Piss. Uh. I don't want to eat all my food. I kind of need some of that. Just need like one. Wait. Just one, wait. I guess we could drop ten of these. I didn't fucking drop them all. Oh, well, it's allowed me to move at the very least. Okay, let's try not to loot anything more. I want to go out that big tube. 
So let's see if we can. Uh, Glowstone Grotto. Then we go back inside. Go down the water chutes. I already know it's gonna happen, but I just I want to see it happen. You know. Maybe there's something on the way down. I don't know. Or maybe we just fall to our death. Ooh. Okay. Well, I mean, it's about what I expected, I guess. Anything like here? No. Why doesn't Skyrim have a breath meter? <laughs> I'm gonna complain about that again. Oh, damn it. Alright, whatever the case, we're outside. We made it. Did I check this ship? Probably did. Yes, I did. I remember this. We're ready to go back. And go back, we will. Still a lot to explore here, but I think this is mostly farm stuff. But we're not going to do much exploring without some freaking... Space. Problem is, Avengers in this don't have unli unlimited money. So they're going to run out rather rapidly. Miracle that must have been Come back. due to which Okay. Let's put on our, our fancy stuff. Uh, is this Red Rex eight points? Yes. Okay. I think I have a Red Rex book actually I could read. What is it? Elemental crafting book rhetoric. Yeah. Walking expert? We're definitely not at the point where we need that. Say these. Sir. Brought forth by yeah. What? Nah, I just put them out for you to look at. Tell me what you need, and be quick about it. That is a stupid question. Like, why would you say, are your wares for sale? Like, no. <laughs> no. No, they're not. I mean, I, I guess he, you know, he tells us. By these rhetoric books, I'll weave them by the rhetoric expert book. A lot of money, right? Forgot we haven't sold anything yet. That was just the money we collected along the way. This will help us get more yet more money. We have forty-eight. Ooh, we're damn close to fifty. I can get fifty if I buy both those books for expensive. Is it worth it? Probably not. Like, using a master book in the adept here is pretty bad. Walk blessed. But at the uh -huh. same time, like. No, I just put them out for you to look at. I don't know. Tell me what you need and be quick about it. Alright, take these. And then we will take some of these. Where is it? I will definitely take this. 414 to get us up to 50. I think I'll do it. I'm going to use them as I go so we get better deals. Maybe it's for you. Yeah, that's fine. 49. Walk bless. Yeah. Because once we hit 50, we get the next tier. So. Tell me what you need and be quick about it. I think it'd be good. Okay, let's keep that. Sell these. Uh, assassin's hoods. We can get rid of these. I want to get rid of that. Keep those. Keep all set scene set uh, set parts. I think from here on, at the very least. Maybe only the heavy armor ones. Well, I'm kind of curious to see them. You know, I don't know. Okay. Oh yeah, gems. <laughs> we could probably just 
clean them out with gems. Although gems don't weigh anything. Walk. Yeah. Your stuff does weigh stuff. I did find a blacksmith though, so that's good. All right, take these. Let's take everything from him. Let's take your core sword as well. Uh, what else? I prefer you wore your helmet and not my helmet. <laughs> does he even use bows? Doesn't seem like it. He uses magic. He doesn't really need them, does he? So I'll just take them all. Like, why is he wearing this over this? They're both heavy armor, except one is extremely powerful. <laughs> I don't know. We'll never know. The secrets of Marcus. He's just so elusive. Also, he has three torches, which he doesn't need. Pretty sure he doesn't everyone. run his torch out. No. I just put them out for you to look at. Tell me what you need, and be quick about it. Okay, what can I sell? One of these. I will now buy your book. Dark Master. Such a waste. <laughs> I don't care. Ooh. I just want to get to this 50. just want to round it off, you know? Surely it's understandable. Walk. Even if it's not efficient. No, I just put them out for you to look at. Okay. Tell me what you need and be quick about it. So I'll get rid of this. And these. Hmm. Those 34. Sell this for 49, I guess. Also enough. I still have quite a bit to sell. I still have stuff in my chest, also. Yes? Lord. Just everybody talking. So our rhetoric is... 63 now. Wow. But it has a base of 50. Sure. Pretty legit. Okay, what do you buy? You buy gems? You buy soul gems? Okay. Buy these spell tomes? That's good. There's a lot of money, but I don't really have enough to sell her, I don't think. Uh, I'll keep scrolls. Scrolls weigh 0. 0.5? Hmm. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Ah, here we go. Here's where we make the money. Ice wall. So keep this for now. Walk blast. We're also gonna sell some shiz. Apples, dates, bananas. Come the right here. Oh, the blacksmith, of course. From the Red Sea. Let's quick save before we go through this door. What happens if you quick save and you go through a door and crash? The best from the I guess it would just corrupt your save, maybe? That'd be bad. Go to this beautiful country. Let me know when something. If you go through while it's still saving, I guess. Catches your interest. Looking for steel. Everything for the path. Here for the riddle soldier. of steel. Alright, what's up, Core Sword? It's cool, but it's outside as welcome. Uh, room battle axe, bows. Oh yeah, he's got so much money. Blacksmiths, of course, have a lot of money. They're dealing heavy, you know, heavy cost things. I don't think we need either of these anymore. Screw them. I value carry weight over not. I don't really need a turn of stuff. I can't think of any point where we're gonna need it. And I'll sell all the Pyrian shields. They're cool. But, you know. I can sell one. Sell rune helmets. One of these. What does he have for us? Surely something. 
I suppose you sell any, uh... Oh, he actually had Pyrian Gauntlets. Oh. Pyrian Boots. He doesn't have Ebony stuff, though, or whatever it's called. <laughs> Fair enough. He does have 5 million blueprints, though. That's... That's a thing. I don't think we want that right now, though. I got 4K. I think we just take Comagine. that money and put it in the bank while we're adventuring. What is this? Leather goods? Maybe they'll buy something. Yes. Of course. Okay. I... Uh, do I have anything else I want to sell? Yes. That can go. So both of them buy armor and weapons. That's good. Those two stores right next to each other. That's handy. Alright, for now. Yes. Then we'll just throw the rest of the stuff in the box, maybe. Huh? Can I help you? Okay, so we don't want old iron arrows. I don't know why I have those on me. I don't want the set of Salon stuff, or this, or... That. Or those. We probably have a lot of amulets and rings we could sell, actually, now that I think about it. Where could we sell them, though? Noble Quarters? Maybe? Probably. I'll try there. Okay, we've got to sell these as well. Did that leather worker offer to buy these? She bought the heavy shield. I don't know. Right, let's put these in there. Or ingots. Okay, and uh, I guess all the alchemy ingredients for now. That'll save us a lot of space. Come back and do alchemy later on. We're ready to do it. Not at that point. We have a lot, <laughs> a lot of stuff. Right, we're getting there. 249, we're getting down. We have a lot of potions we don't need as well. Right, what I'm going to do is go in the bank, deposit what I have. Walk blessed, my son. Of course. Okay, we're going to deposit all our money. Of course. We now make 401 pennies per day, plus 5 for the shares thing. Pretty good. See, we're getting money. What blessing. It's working. Okay, we already have a quest. My okay. Sir. So let's go to the noble quarters. <laughs> See what we can finish off. In our inventory, and then we'll go back out and adventure. It's good. We're basically in that gameplay loop right now where we just need to go adventuring, selling, come back. Come back, selling, rather, in that order. <laughs> adventure again. It's a repeat. So we have a ton of cash. Got a lot of levels under our belt. Oh, yes, this guy's store who doesn't have music. If I remember, I'll add music oh, in his store again, like I did with the last episode, or the last time I was in here, rather. Okay, so... Take these. He's got a lot of coin. Very good. That's what I want to see. Oh yeah. Take all of these things. Beautiful. 
Anything else we don't need here? Uh, not sure. I don't really want to spend all my time looking, so... Yeah. Just have a look at his stuff real quick. I'll buy... A couple more of those. And... There is an alchemy store just to the right of this, actually. Yeah. Maybe later. Take care. Do I have enough ambrosia is the next question. Let me use one now. Puts us a zero. I think we have enough for now. Alright, now we just go to the bank. Put the rest of the money in there. And we're ready. You guess around 500 a day in interest, which is pretty, pretty damn good. people of this holy city. That mod that allows me to up the amount of interest I can get over 250. Very nice. Hello. How may I be of service? Walk blend. Of course. Okay, deposits. All of it. A wise decision. Of course. 450 a day. Was it already at 450? Maybe it caps out at 450. Uh, what if I withdraw a thousand? Mm -hmm. Still at 450? Oh. Okay. A wise decision. Just happened to round off at 450. Cool. Alright. So we're out of money. We need to go get more money. Let's freaking do it. to the uh, Golden Forest area. Well, we can explore around here more. I don't think there's going to be anything other than farms. There's probably quests here and stuff. Should we go look? Maybe. They might have a quest to go kill some bandits or something. I don't know. I'll talk to the people in there. And if not, then we'll just leave, I guess. Huh? Hello. Wait, I think I know you. You work for the Order, don't you? Why are those wild mages up in the temple? Malthus, forgive my doubts, but why would the Grand Master side with heretics? It just doesn't add up. I don't know. <laughs> hey, Talk to you later, or not. An adventurer, are you? Have you been to... Alright, let's see if we can go to the uh, landlord house or whatever it was called. If anyone's gonna have something, it's gonna be him, probably. You're a hunter? How's the situation in the wilderness? Uh, don't ask. The wolves act as if they've been cursed, attacking anything and anyone on sight, and killing game they don't even eat afterwards. This must be the red madness everyone's talking about. <sighs> oh, blazes. Where's this supposed to lead? Good question. I'm new in this area. Do you happen to have any tip for me? Tips. Tips. It just be wary if you're outside city walls. Thy name I is my guess you've noticed as much I already, but I will honor this country you. has seen better as days. I have noticed. Farewell. Thank you, Bartor. Tough times indeed. Uh, tough times. Guess I'll have a luck. Fuck it. Maybe there'll be a ice claw in here or something. I'm not in here to steal from these people. Oh my god, there's actually an ice claw in here. Sick. Oh! I like the shield bash though. Pretty nosh. I like most of the sounds this has. If not all of them, of course. <laughs> I'm curious what's in this basement. Is this more sinister than... This feels kind of sinister. For a farm basement, doesn't it? I mean, this feels alright, but that room with like the purple look to it. 
Oh. Skeletons. That's not what I was expecting. I think we need to bring our boy with us. There we go. Welcome to hell. Oops. I don't know why I'm taking bone meal. Pretty sure I said I would stop taking bone meal. Either that and this Skyrim playthrough. What I'm doing, or this. Or maybe even Oblivion. <laughs> Probably all three of those. It applies. I have enough bone meal. Right, these aren't worth very much. Yeah, I'm not taking more bone meal, I think. I have enough. I don't even want the old iron arrows. Old iron arrows, rather. You could have them back. They're just bad. Are really this desperate for coins? Yes. <laughs> Alright. There we go. Nice. What is the deal with this? Oh. Just a rude Kyrus down here. Did I ever have a rude Kyrus? I'm wearing one, aren't I? No, I'm not. Ooh. Cool. We actually get to see what it looks like. It's cool. It's actually really good. I like it. It would go well with the rune helmet that we just sold. Oh, shit. But of course we have a, a new rune helmet, so... With the rune gauntlet still? I'm gonna continue to wear those. I use the bow enough to the point where I think I'm just gonna keep wearing these. That actually works pretty well together. Some of the armor sets, like the reskins, look pretty nice together. We need to find a cape that isn't like that one that we have that doesn't really work with normal armor. That's what I want. It hasn't happened yet. Okay. So I just went in a circle? What do you do with this? Hello. This is totally not what I was expecting down here. I mean, I don't know what I was expecting in a basement, but... You know. <laughs> it wasn't undead in, like, dungeon gloom. You gotta say, I'm not, uh, I'm not sad about it. If there's ever one thing I do want to find, it's dungeon gloom. Maybe not always undead. Can I jump? We found an upgraded chess piece, that's pretty cool. Yeah, this, this looks interesting. Where's a key? Hmm. There's a massive chest in there. I suppose the key's on the floor or anything. I could... No. I was gonna say I could do the old telekinesis trick. So either there is an actual key or there's a lever that opens that door. I don't know. We haven't gone to the cellar storeroom yet. I also don't think I've gone up there. How to get through here again? Actually, let me double check this isn't where they would have hid the switch. This farmhouse has turned out to be quite interesting. All right, this way. Do a little jump. Okay, we're just back here. But I didn't find that before, so... Good. Very good. Ah, balls. What's in the box? Ring of the Blade Master. One hand attacks you 15% more damage. You know what? That's actually good. Ha! Ah. Would I rather wear that or Ring of the Eagle Eye? I don't, I do more melee attacking than I do bow attacking, and it's a bigger amount. So yeah. Sweet! New ring! The sewer- this sewer- this cellar is awesome! <laughs> Night Manuscript. What the hell is that? Don't know, but I'm taking it. Also, none of this stuff is even stealing, which is odd. 
They just don't even care. I guess because it got infected with undead. Infected? Infested. That's the word I would be using instead of that. If it was like a fungus, maybe it would be infected. Where is that room? Here. Are we in normal territory now? <laughs> Hard to say. Well, this is a nice mess you've got me into. Look at all this meat. Meat! It's back on the menu. Oh. Hello. Borax key. Is that literally the key to the place downstairs? That'd be amazing. Ah. <clears throat> Just go back inside real quick. <laughs> Jamie didn't come out here. So this is stealing. Right. I'll take that. It's worth it. Could always use it for recharging enchanted items or something. This is the side door. Oh, nope, it's not. Oh, I see. Right, this is where we were looking down at that one guy. I just don't respect the others anymore. But that's how it is. Life is what you Okay. Now let's see if this key goes to what I really wanted to go to. If not, I have no idea where else to open this door from. Uh, is it down here? Also, I can't remember. Somewhere around here. There we go. Please work. Oh, score. Alright. What's in the chest? Yeah, the garden is alright. That's it, though. <laughs> it's kind of, kind of random, huh? But you know what? I'll take it. Free loot. I don't think we can go in there, nor would I want to. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it's been profitable. I accept. Let's get out of this barn. And I'll be right back. Alright. Let's roll. Who's Barrick? Was he Barrick? No. I haven't actually met Barrick yet. But we have his key. Oh. Oh, Borak, sorry. Oh, Borak. Walk blessed. You're not Borak. <laughs> Hello. You have anything to trade? I found some stuff. I might. What Ooh. do you need? Oh. And what do you buy? Buy my poisons. Okay, hang on. Some of these poisons are trash, so I'm quite happy to Travels. get rid of them. I might. What do you need? And I'll buy your... Food actually works as food. Amount of money. Right. Yeah, let's just sell everything except for the paralysis poison, I guess. All pretty useless, quite frankly. Then you sell me roasted beef, cheese, and poultry meat. Let's do. Okay, seems good. The spare part, I guess. <laughs> uh, anything else? Don't think so. May his light you. What'd you say? <laughs> it like cut out. It's like may light you. What? What? Yeah. Let's get these books read, eh? All right, where's Borek? Where's old Borat? Is he not home? 
I mean, maybe he's outside. Oh, well. Just have a little look around. They won't mind. How can I resist? It's free money. Oh. I think we're taking this. <laughs> Five pennies a day for me. Seems good. Bank vault key of Borak. Oh my god, what? We are cleaning Borak out, and I don't even know the man. This is incredible. <laughs> Poor Borak. He's getting wrecked. I hope he's an asshole. How am I? Then we can justify all this. Is to pay that much. Although I'm not going to justify right. this. Right. Who needs justification? Very good. Yes. Ah, my yes. little Borak. Oh, he doesn't even yes. talk. Hi. I, uh... Bye. <laughs> okay. Oh, the smithy here as well. My sir. You don't actually fucking sell? I just don't respect the elders anymore. Come on. If they had an actual vendor out here, it'd be great. You nearly are one traveler, huh? You got some guts to go sorting about these days. Yeah, I saunter all over the place. Yeah, well, we've been in there. Although I don't recall coming out of this door. Oh, it was the front door. Why did I go back in here? Alright. Well, we can put that thing in the bank later when we get back and check out the vault key. Or we could just do it now. Let's go do it now, because I'll forget otherwise. Probably. Also, I really want to see what's in the vault, not gonna lie. It's probably not gonna be that exciting, but whatever. Also, oh no! So of course the game crashed, and I hadn't saved since we first left Ark <laughs> to come back to here. So I had to do the whole thing I just did for the past 15 minutes again, the whole sewer bit and whatever. I saved you all that mess though. Now hopefully it doesn't crash this time. We can actually do what I'm trying to do here. I remember to save this time. There we go. A miracle has happened. A miracle that My sir. I should have remembered to save when going outside of that place. Anytime I go from indoors to outdoors and travel, I should save. And when I don't, I have no one to blame but myself, pretty much. <laughs> but it does suck. Alright, uh, let's give him this note thing. Walk blessed, my sir. How can Sylvan and friends serve you today? Turn a shareholding. You do? Let me have a look. Hmm. Very well, this looks solid. We will add any future gains from this holding to your vault. Wonderful. <laughs> Hello. Okay. How may I be of service? Of course. So how much are we making now? 473 pennies a day. Very good. Walk blessing. That'll add up. Don't forget your money. That'll add up nicely. Alright, now we gotta find Borek's vault. Not sure which one that is, but it's one of the ones that is open. Okay. I mean, eventually we could just pick. A basket just ruined me. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, none of these. Let me just have a, like, a... Oh, have the ice claw, first of all. I guess honey. Greetings. Hello! Ooh, if we get master, we can go in there as well. Wow. Are those two shareholding things? Like, gold bars? <sighs> Pretty good. I kind of want to be a master thief. <laughs> it's just very lucrative. Wait. They just sit on their asses and hope things settle themselves. Wait, what? Idiots. Is that a real book? No. 
We have a master lockpick scroll, or our last master scroll. Oh, this is stealing. Can you like leave? I mean, we're gonna have to go to the Undercity probably to get rid of these, but that's fine. Nice. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do it. Where else are we gonna use this master lock scroll? Unlock scroll. Uh, Scroolables? No, scroll rips. There it is. Go too easy. Let's save. We could save scout this and just see which one's better, but I'm not gonna do that. Oh, Mercer. <sighs> Twenty-six pennies, a grand soul gem, and a weird thing. Okay. It tells me the other one might have been better. Wait a second. I said I wouldn't save scum, but I forgot I could open this door. I would much rather go in there. I lied. <laughs> I mean, think about it. This is so much better. I would have used it on this had I remembered this was Master Door Lock. Come on. Yeah. Silver, nice. <laughs> We're not even a thief character, but somehow here I am. But that said, we're not not a thief character. You know? I said I'd do whatever. We're morally gray area. Oh, these aren't what I thought they were. I thought they were landholder share things I could give to the dude. I mean, this is still worth more as long as we go sell these things. Yeah, it's not as if I didn't tell them that already. <clears throat> We're going our way. <laughs> Never mind that. Why do I have my face out? Okay. How much gold do we get? Two hundred sixty-one gold. We have. Four silver ingots, ten gold ingots, two diamonds, a grand soul gem. No, we didn't get the grand soul gem there. We only got one diamond from there, I think. Pretty good, though. Alright, we'll go sell that stuff later. We'll put it in here just in case we ever get trouble with the law or something. It doesn't get taken away from us. These things might happen sometimes. You never know. Okay. Uh, no. 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 Oh yeah, I got a disease. I should probably take care of that. <laughs> that rat in the basement gave me, gave me disease. Ahoy! Ahoy! Do you have money? Huh? Again? Uh huh. No, I just put them out for you. Hey, Tell me what you need and be quick about it. You take that from me now. So let's carry it around anymore. And I think that's really all we need to sell. There's something else. Oh. Alright. I will walk blessed. Why does he sound so angry about it? Walk well, blessed, you son of a bitch. Right, we're gonna go to Lion Farm and we're gonna go south. Explore a little bit. We only got like eight minutes ish left in this episode anyway, so. Let's just have a little romp around. There's some sort of ruin in my map. Compass. Could be something that we could explore next time.
Should we get down this mountain? Precariously, of course. Let's bring a... Well, I probably should have waited until we were at the bottom before doing that. Let's go back. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> what am I supposed to do with this? What is this? There you go. So what do we have here? Can I go into here? Water's pushing me away. Probably not a door, if I had to guess. It's too strong. And I mean, it doesn't look like it opens anyway. Just a big grate. We can get like over there. We'll see what this big tree on the mini map or the uh, compasses as well. Maybe something interesting. If I can get over there, that is. Ooh. Ah, it's probably a way up. Let's be honest. Just keep going downstream. I hope. <laughs> I don't actually know, of course. This looks promising ish. Oh, we can't jump very high, though. I guess I could go to that bridge and just go left. That could work. Assuming I get on the bridge. Have we been here? No, this is more farmland, but a new farmland. I like all the farmland outside the town. Like, it feels... There would be farmland, you know? A lot of games don't put farmland, like, outside villages and stuff like they should be. Like, that's that's how you feed your city. <laughs> you have... Farmland. Somebody told us to meet them at the Red Ox, didn't they? Did I get that again? I think I... Forgot to read that note the second time, actually. Tough time. Best batch of spice May ever had. Gross pull. Oh. Well, let's... well, I mean, we can still go up there and talk to them, even though we didn't get the sign. Okay, so it's some big old tavern. Nice. Could use a way to get to the night anyway, honestly. I don't fancy going on a romp through the freaking darkness in the woods. There you are. Very good. He found his way. Well done, Marcus. Bridgehead Farm. Watchtower? War on Nerum. War on Kile. Red Madness. The fuck is wrong with this world? Hmm? What do you want? Are you Meryl Hoofsmith? I read the notice. You did? Hell, we did. And here I'd almost given up hope. What do you need? Before we take this conversation any further, I hardly have any money left. So if you decide to help me, know that no riches await you. Mm. <laughs> In that case, I'm sorry. Fuck off. No. I will do it. Tell me what this is about first, then I'll decide whether or not to help you. Mm. Fine. My daughter, Bea. She's sick. It happened about a moon ago. Fever, nausea, pain in all her limbs. You already talked to an apothecary? Well, that's the thing. Old Marlin, the apothecary who took care of us farm folk, got mauled by a bear last year. He didn't make it. You can't imagine how bad it was. I tried everything, but nothing helped. Bea only got worse and worse. Uh, why didn't you just go to the city? There are healers there. <laughs> and who would have cared for Bea in the meantime? No. I couldn't leave her alone like that. Not for that long. I see. How is she now? Still sick. But, you see, two weeks ago I met a traveler in the Red Ox. An apothecary. He didn't wear the yellow robes, but... 
He undoubtedly knew his craft. I told him about Bea, and he offered to examine her. For free. Did you find out anything? Yes. Bea has belly worms. Ugh. Belly worms? Yes. A rare illness from Kira. She must have gotten it from one of the coal men in the city, where she sells our harvest every week. The apothecary said that Endralian remedies wouldn't help, but that he knew a recipe Kira because he had friend. studied in Kira himself. Okay, then what do you need my help for? Well, that's the thing. The ingredients are... unusual. And I don't have the slightest idea where to get them. Here, take a look. We're a collector of ingredients. Okay. The ingredients for the elixir. Let's see. Ingredients... Uh, I wish I would have saw what it was called. <laughs> uh, jeez. Morel's recipe? Ah. Recipe for an elixir against intestinal worms, certificated by the League of the Apothecary. Ingredients. One portion of rat meat, one batch of garlic, one pair of yellow butterfly wings, one burn root. That sounds like I probably have those things. Mm -hmm. So you're looking for a mercenary to find the ingredients to brew the potion? Exactly. Look, my sir, I know times are tough, but if you can find the ingredients and brew this potion for me, I'd be eternally grateful. And of course, I'd pay you. Not much, but what I can afford. Alright, I'll see what I can do. Really? I... I appreciate that. Malphus himself must have sent you. If you're a traveler, you surely have a map with you, don't you? Let me see. Here. This is my farm. Just go there once you have the elixir brewed. I'll be waiting. And again. Thank you. Oh. I feel like I'm doing a good deed. Or something. What do you want? Just spit it out. Uh, nothing. Nothing at all. Okay, yeah, we can get those. Let's go stay the night in the Red Ox, though. Maybe there's some more quests in here or something. Mm -hmm. Anything War to say? No? War on Kile. Red Madness. The fuck is wrong? Huh? What do you want? Interesting tavern. It's kind of like a... <sighs> it's not a barn. I don't know. Huh? What do you want? Malfas's blessings. I'm looking for a room for the night. And our room's looking for you. It's no Ark Noble Quarter, but it's warm and clean. Want it? Ten pennies? Good. Yeah. We'll open up the room for you. And please, no shame. Oh, 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 we walk the oh, righteous path in here and don't want any trouble. Hanging in there, I guess. And you? No flashes, blessing. Fucking Skyrim. <laughs> keep getting hurt by random objects. Let me quick save. I feel like it was about to crash there for a second. I see, it is a barn, more or less. <laughs> I see why it's ten pennies. Ah, this must be the one. Let's have a look around, though. Well, that was fun. Alright. It's not very... Not very private, but it'll do, I guess. I need to sleep through the night anyway. And I need to end this video before I forget. So I guess I'll do that after we're done sleeping. I'm not going to go back to the city quite yet and brew this potion. But I will. Of course. Let's put on our stuff as well. Thank God that rune carries is still down there when I went down there the second time. I was worried it wouldn't be. It would just be some random thing. Oh, he looks so cool. I like it. Alright, well that has been another episode of Enderall. So next time we'll, uh, we'll, we will brew that potion, I guess. I'll see if I have the ingredients. But first we're going to go look around a bit more. See what we can find. See what trouble we can get into. So if you enjoyed, leave a like. And I will catch you guys in the next episode. See you next time.